What's up, YouTube? Simply. Oh, I'm luckier. And today we're continuing our sealed only challenge for Team Walmart. But first, I want to ask you to check out the channel, subscribe for more epic Yu Gi Oh videos, and please remember to give this video a thumbs up if you enjoy the content. So, our last video, we didn't have the prices edited on the screen, so we're actually going to have that for the beginning of this video to see if we ended up getting that $300 challenge. And then we'll also be continuing the challenge to see if we got even more value out of these booster packs here. And speaking of these booster packs, let's check it out. This is Dark Crisis, an Invasion of Chaos. I'm very excited for this, you guys. This is the classic booster packs and probably two of the most uh, nostalgic booster packs for me because of uh, all the epic cards inside. So not only, you guys, are these the nostalgic packs uh, from the past, Beautiful sets. Invasion of Chaos, my favorite Yu-Gi-Oh set. We're actually looking for Chaos cards. Can you guys believe that? This, we actually need Chaos cards. Let's talk about a couple in Dark Crisis. Dark Crisis has DD Warrior Lady, Reflect Bounder, if you guys remember Reflect Bounder. That was actually used as one of the more popular light monsters in the Chaos deck back in the day. Um, then, of course, you have Summon Skull of Lightning. I forget, Skull Archfiend of Lightning, and then Vampire Lords in here, that'd just be cool to pull, as well as the Almighty in the back. You see him, Exodian Net Cross, because for some reason I cannot pull that guy, and I would really like to pull him for you guys. So now, let's talk about Invasion of Chaos, though. Invasion of Chaos, my favorite set, one of the best Yu-Gi-Oh sets ever made, changed the format for five plus years. It comes with Chaos Emperor Dragon Envoy of the End. And I know he's been errated, so we definitely can play him even if we are following the ban list. Definitely, definitely would be good in our deck, you guys, for sure. Also, Black Luster Soldier, Envoy the Beginning, one of my favorite cards in general, and would be amazing in our deck, along with Dark Magician of Chaos. Dimension Fusion's in here, so if we're following a ban list, uh, not so bueno, but extremely good if we are, <laughs> if we are not. So uh, I'm very excited for that, you guys. So we're going to start up with Dark Crisis. Here we go. First booster pack. Believe in the heart of the cards. We also have our Ash Blossom sleeves today and uh, very beautiful. We have them on superlucky.com if you guys are interested. First pack, here we go. Believe. Battle Scarred. Come on, Team Walmart. <laughs> Arsenal Robber. Blindly Loyal Goblin. Sasuke Samurai number two. Fear from the dark. And these are the worldwide edition packs, so there will be a rare and a foil if we can pull a foil. Uh, Black Ironsmith. Our Blacksmith Kotetsu. Nice, searching for those equip cards. Precious cards from beyond. Successfully attribute some draw to Pandemonium. Oh man, Frozen Soul. One of my favorite cards right there. That is Pandemonium. That is beautiful. Maybe we'll get some Archfiend cards to go with. Okay, next pack. This is the Dark Crisis. Dice Reroll. Oh man, I love the classic cards, you guys. Twin Swords, Flashing Light Trice. Spell Reproduction, Guardian Elma. Great Mahu Garzette, actually very popular card. Um, gets a double the attack of the monster you tribute. Shooting Star Bow, really eternal rest. Dark Scorpion Chick the Yellow, Contract with the Dark Master. That is amazing, wow. Um, and then definitely gonna have to do a whiff of this booster pack. I feel like if we do that, we might, we might get some better cards. So here we go guys, believe. Oh, I smell a Dark Crisis. Okay, here we go. Believe. Cyber Raider. Thousand Needles. The final countdown. Gaga Giga. Infernal Queen Archfiend. Battle Footballer. Outstanding Dog. The Mahu Garzettes. This is the great Mahu Garzette over there. Okay, because I just wanted to put two of them. Interesting. Actually, Cards from each of the original attack of the two monsters tribute. Oh man, another pandemonium. I like that. I like pandemonium, guys. Okay, here we go. Can so out of uh, I think we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine booster packs. We're hoping for two fours. I know these are classic packs. Don't have the best ratio for pulling foils, but we're gonna make it happen. Must ring of the dark scorpions. Contract with Exodia. Love that picture. That's a sign. I feel like we're gonna make it happen. Final attack orders. Little Wingard, Dark Bishop. Wow, we got the Queen and the Bishop. Dark Scorpion. Agido, Shinato. That'd be a cool pull. Archfiend's Oath. I actually used to play around with that card a lot when I was when I was a kid. Pay forever in life. Points declare a card name and pick up the top card of your deck. If it was there, add it to your hand. 
We send the card to the grave. I think I used it with convulsions of nature. If you guys remember that card, flip your deck upside down. Good stuff. Good stuff. Wombo combos back in the old school days, the classic days of Yu Gi Oh! All right, Vile Pawn Archfiend. Mustering of the Dark Scorpions. Ray of Hope. I always like that picture. What are those, what are those monsters there? That's the, uh, the Picaroos? No, that's not Picaroo. The, uh... Oh, baby, a secret rare vampire lord. What? What? Are you kidding me? Let's check him out. Let's check him out. Yo, Kaiba. Look at Kaiba right there. Look, look at Kaiba. He's like, yeah, man, that's, that's my vampire lord. That's my vampire lord. You guys, this is incredible to get a secret rare. All right, each time this card inflicts battle damage to your opponent, declare a card type, monster, spell, or trap. Definitely probably shouldn't click declare monster because how good monsters are these days uh, in the grave. But spell or trap, your opponent selects that card type from the deck and says to the grave, wow. This card is destroyed or sent from the field to the graveyard by opponent's card effect. Special summon it during your next standby phase. I feel like, I feel like we have to, we have to play this guy in our deck. This is the OG, the Vampire Lord, and he looks gorgeous. Wow. Okay. Set that to the side. Oh, yeah, Gyaku Giri Panda, that's a good one. Um, Dark Scorpion, Final Footballer, that's the one around. I feel like we should, should, we, we should give him a sleeve, huh? Okay. <laughs> All right, Ash Blossom. Get some love from the Vampire Lord. I can't believe we pulled Vampire Lord. That is crazy. All right, you guys, we get another secret rare. This is just pure godliness. If we get any of those cards we were talking about, we already got one of them. Your godliness, so it's already insane. We got a secret rare, and you guys, you weren't even guaranteed a secret rare in the classic days. So, pulling a secret rare from less than 24 packs is very nice. Can we get an ultra rare? Honestly, I would go uh, obliterating all over the place if we got an exodian that cross. Also, for tribute, happy <laughs> ass Carl, Gorg the Strong, Zolga, Des Feral Amp, all right, Guardian KS, Kelbeck. Arsenal Summer and Frozen Soul. Very nice. All right, another Dark Crisis Booster Pack. Gosh, dude, Vampire Lord is so cool. Look at that guy. Look at him just chilling. He's like, yes. Okay, next pack. Here we go. Rods of Mind's Eye. Incandescent Ordeal. Ooh, ooh, ooh. No, Sukiyomi, yes. Different Dimension Dragon, super rare. This card cannot be destroyed by effects of a spell or a trap card that does not target it. That does, yeah, okay. This card cannot be destroyed as a result of battle against monster with knights or one attack. It is a light monster, so it's potentially playable, um, but the card to take note of here is Suki. Um, one of the best dark monsters probably in the game for a long time, and uh, probably not so good anymore since Lynx can't flip face down, <laughs> but uh, it was very good. It was known as the Monarch Killer for a while. Suki, um, Keldo, Shinaito, Ojama Trio, there we go with uh, Gyaku Giri Panda over there. So, a uh, wombo combo. And, uh, yes. Okay, set our, set our Suchi, Sukiyomi over there. Two more booster packs left. I feel like it's not over yet. We got two foils. Can we get a third for the, for the godliness? Fairy Spring, Spell Reproduction, Battle Scarred, Falling Down, uh, one of the better Snatch Steel type cards in the game for Archfiends. All right, the Parasite. Speaking of Parasite, crazy new movie that just came out. Uh, Checkmate, Really Eternal Rest, Mograzette, and Agito. Going down, possibly playable. All right, last pack of Destiny for this booster pack here. We've already called upon Kaiba, but just one more time. Kaiba! Little Wingard. Morale boost, Incandescent Ordeal. Final attack orders, fear from the dead. Frozen Soul, man, another pandemonium. It's one of my favorites. Okay, guys, this booster pack has the pandemonium. It has the chaos. So now we're gonna go into invasion of chaos. Let's see if we can continue the pandemonium. All right, here we go. Invasion of chaos. Let's let it invade into our sealed only deck. Hashtag Team Walmart. First pack. I'm gonna start, I'm gonna start with a whiff. So here we go. Invasion of chaos. Yes. First pack. Honestly, you guys, we just need, just need that, uh, those envoys. Beginning or the end. And our deck would be uh, extraordinary here. Giga. All right. Giga, Gaga, Gigo. 
interesting. I was like, didn't we just pull this guy? But we didn't, it was the other one. Dimension distortion, zero gravity, stumble in. Compo wow, compulsory evacuation device. That's actually a very good card for the booster deck, you guys, for the seal only deck, so. Uh, Neobug, self-destruct button. Wow, man, you have 10,000 hands. Got our value back on this booster pack. That's, uh, that's a nice pack. Invasion of Chaos, baby. So we're gonna set this over here. Sadly, we're not playing rituals, but we're gonna make it happen with some pandemonium. Here we go. Gora, Turtle of Illusion. Blasting of the Ruins. Multiplication of Ants. Gale Lizard. Curse of Darkness, cool. I always like how it's like a little force field looking thing. Uh, Self-destruct button. Wow, another Manju. Okay, we'll keep that coming. Fiend Hands Mirror. DNA Transplant. What are the monsters here? I'm always curious. Some trolls or something? Another Manju though, very nice. Okay. Believe in the heart of the cards, you guys. This is where it counts. This is where it all happens. Oh man, oh man, it's another Gaga Gigo. Yeah, yeah! Anti-aircraft flower. Smashing ground, that's another playable card. Gora Turtle. Sasuke Samurai, nice. Like those Sasuke so Soul Absorption, Fenrir, Ojama Black, nice, got the Ojamas. He's one of the uh, Ojama Trio. Triple Fairy. Smashing Ground, that cool card there. Okay. Three more packs of Invasion of Chaos. My favorite set of Yu-Gi-Oh. Let's take a look at Kaiba real quick. He's right there, he's just, he's hanging out. Actually, you know what, you're right. Let's take a look at the Kaiba over there. There he is. You guys see him? He's he's watching. He's just like Invasion of Chaos. You know, it's not it's not that much of a third rate set. You know, it's more of a first rate set. I think that's what he's thinking. So uh, for Kaiba, you guys, here we go. Give it to us, Kaiba. Dun, 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 dun. Dun, 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 Another smashing ground. Go to the turtle. Blasting the ruins. Multiplication of ants. Stray Lambs, a little cutie cutie card. Tower of Babel, fun card to mess around. Chaos End, that's a cool card. You can activate this card if you have seven or more cards that are currently removed from play. Destroy all monsters on the field, a little dark hole action. Terror King Salmon and Necromancer, number of monsters in your graveyard times 300. Yeah, nice. And uh, just for the chaos, maybe we can summon some more chaos. What is going on with that picture, by the way, you guys? You see this? I don't even know. A whole bunch of trees getting sucked into the chaos vortex. Right. Last two packs. Got at least, can we get at least a foil card from the Vision of Chaos here? Gigante is very nice. War Turtle again, that guy's just always there. Jade Insect. And then over here, what? 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 Black Master Soldier, and one of the beginning. Oh baby, here we go, what? How is this guy always here for us? Yo! What? That's crazy! Let's, let's get a picture of Vampire Lord. What? What? The pure godliness. He came. He saw. He conquered. What? What? Another man who's in here. Gosh darn man. Invasion. I told you guys, Invasion Chaos, man. That's my, that's the set right there. Wow. Did that really just happen? Straight out of the pack. Blackluster Soldier, Envoy, what? I think even even little cameraman, simply cameraman over here and I were like, did that really just happen right now? We're, we're just, can you guys believe this is this is happening? That is Blackluster Soldier, Invasion of Chaos. Come on, you need to get back, back out of the picture. There we go. Wow, you guys, absolutely incredible. And this is a 3,000 attack, 3,000 attack, 2,500 defense monster. One of the best in the game. All right, let's read his effect here. This card can be special summoned by removing play one light and one dark monster in the grave. Once during each of your turns. Wait, wait, this is the old one. <laughs> you can select and activate one of the following effects. Remove play one monster in the field. If you activate this effect, cannot attack. This destroys the monster's old battle can attack once again in a row. All right. We're gonna sleeve them up with our Ash Blossom sleeves. I cannot believe we just pulled Black Luster Soldier. Wow, that was absolutely just pure godliness, you guys. I don't even know what happened there for a moment, 
It was just disbelief, I think, when we pulled the Chaos uh, Black Lesser Soldier Envoy at the beginning. That was, that, was, that was something else. So we still have one more booster pack here, but of course this opening has already ent entered the realm of the gods, so they have descended once again. Thank you, uh, Yu-Gi-Oh gods, for supporting our Team Walmart. Man, Team Walmart is getting some epic pools. This is, this is epic. So uh, last pack of Destiny. Are you guys ready? Here we go. Invasion of Chaos. You guys see that Black Luster just chilling? What? That is an ultra rare Black Luster from Invasion of Chaos. I am just, holy black moly. Um, best cards we can get, and void the end obviously, and then Dimension Fusion would be really cool to see just because it's one of my favorites. So, uh, but honestly, we've come here, we've gotten the pool. Let's just see if there's something else we can get. Stumbling. Stealth Bird. Man, that's a great burn card back in the day. Ryu Kaki. Anti-Aircraft. And Metaza the Zapper, my man. I feel like we always pull this guy in the last pack. Sacred Crane, Spatial Collapse, Sylphie, and Crimson Ninja. Wow. 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 I don't even know. Just Vampire Lord just chilling there. What a godly opening. What a godly opening. Wow. Okay. All right. That was the sealed only Walmart challenge. I have a feeling we definitely completed the challenge. Uh, we'll have the value come up on screen as we add, a, add all the cards that we've pulled across all three videos here. That was just pure godliness. It's crazy, you guys. But hopefully you enjoyed the content. Post in the comments below if you're excited for this chaos light sworn deck we're putting together here for Team Walmart. It's gonna be crazy, it's gonna be insane. And as always, thank you so much for watching. Please remember to give the video a thumbs up if you enjoy the content. Subscribe for more godly, godly Yu-Gi-Oh videos. I'm just, what? Chaos Leviathan too in the last video. Black Luster Soldier. Wow. Godly videos, you guys. And super unlucky signing out.